have the biggest Philly event oh. in a long, long time. Maybe ever? I'm it, pretty sure like the next biggest thing would be like a Velocity Fest. Or like <laughs> a Temple Game Room where just everyone happened to show was, up. Was there never a major in Philly? Back in the day, they had like Cactuar and Scar and all in kinds of In the city? And, and this one's technically not in the city either. Because like we have stuff here that Clash, that Chibo would do. Yeah. Um, like, uh, like Smash Adelphia, right? There's also Smash Adelphia, but like in in like past, um, that's not bigger than Gang host a melee tournament, which by the way is going to be everyone's calling just Gang because that is yeah. an atrociously long name. <laughs> EGTV coming coming through with the. Uh, Why don't we just like call it an abbreviation? Call it Gamped. G H A M T. Gang host a melee tournament. Gamped. But th but then you I know the most important part in in the marketing is is the Gang. You know. Yeah. So you, you got you can't you can't lose that. I've heard people calling it Super Event Match. <laughs> Which I think is funny. Who's uh, and I, I understand the uh, the guest list is is looking looking kind of nice. It's looking kind of nice. nice. I don't remember who exactly I saw. There were some top fifty members in there. Some uh, not wait, is this the match? Oh, oh, we is. missed it. We were we were in com okay. And you know what? It looks like Basic Stitch is actually up on bones. He takes the first stock. I uh, cannot tell you exactly how that happened. I usually like to see like what their opening moves are to see how the flow of the game is probably going to go. Mm -hmm. Oh, a little double slap action. So we talked about that in uh, teams earlier. Um, Peach coming down the float canceled aerial, positive on shield. Mm -hmm. You have a very good mix up. Either grab, um, you can do the jab, you can do a down smash, you can do another aerial if you're feeling really fancy. You can dash away. You can dash away as well, yeah. And mm -hmm. um, so you have a really favorable mix up opportunity. That time he gets the double jab and is able to push bones farther to the stage. Basic stitch taking the lead. Yeah, Peach's jab is actually mad. I thought he was going to jab there after getting double laser, just kind of like fast fall down, pep, pep. Put, put two quick ones out. Bones apparently cooled down a little bit, playing row hit. Might not have, uh... Yeah, I mean, the CPUs, were keeping, him, CPUs were keeping him warm, <laughs> uh, uh, Picks one up. All right. There's that back here. So, you know, down, down a stock. Best of five, though. Striking to Dreamland for the opening game. Uh, for, so a little bit of history to put this game into context here. Um, I don't know about this matchup in particular, like Bones versus Basic Stitch. Ah, uh, okay. I do know Basic Stitch, uh, excuse me, Bones traditionally does not like the Peach matchup no. at all. He's been learning it, and um, at AEX, he aimed to time out BMC. Uh, not time him out, or like, you know, just basically shoot a lot of lasers because he wouldn't approach. So it'll be interesting to see um, exactly what lengths Bones will go to in order to take the game from Basic Stitch. I think Basic Stitch might be a little too in your face uh, for that to work against him, but, you know. Yeah, Kevin approaches a lot. Um, oh, they're both Kevin. Uh, Basic Stitch <laughs> approaches a lot, but um. No one, no one's supposed to know Bones is a real name. Oh, I mean, um, are you? Are you? Yeah. Yeah. Well, you're talking about Kevin. Yeah, I was talking about Kevin. Um, <laughs> he, he approaches a lot. I feel like Bones. Oh, he's actually bringing it back. Oh, he couldn't clip him. I don't know. I feel like he doesn't really have have tricks in this uh, this matchup, and he also doesn't work around the Peach tricks super ultra well. Yeah. Um, just like the setups that they look for and things like that. Like, this float, like, I'm really glad he's not trying to down air it because, oh. Jumps into a down smash. Yeah, that's a, you don't like to see that. Oh, my God. He's, uh. Hey, basic stitch is poised to take this first game. Yeah, he's actually doing what I like, Ooh, like, almost called a Nino, where it's like, I'm just going to beat shield by throwing out a down smash when I think you're going to press a button and hope that it hits. Because Nino does that all the time. He doesn't grab your shield. He just he just smash attacks it and just hopes that you jump out. It's extra funny because he's an Ices. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, you know what? Bones has basic stitch close to kill percent. What DI? Yeah, that was amazing DI. Got him. Oh, oh no, I oh. know. I know he tried to grab that turn up. And that's why he fell. I love that, that grab. I don't. I'm not sure. Oh. Bones able to swing it all the way back. Yeah, basic stitch's aggression, even on the recovery, definitely cost him there. I see. Like, I don't know how many of the tricks like um, Falco has, and if Bones knows them, because like <laughs> against against floaties, well, like uh, Falco has these throw mix up. Like, he's got like back throw dare. He's got up throw up air. He's got up throw dare. Like, at least this is this is all like stuff that works against Puff. And I I can't speak for if it works on Peach. But like up there, up here, oh, it's a good time, you know. Watch Ginger stream. Ginger stream, by the way, te ten out of ten stream. Just it's one of super, the good ones. super informative, super like conversational. It's a good time, and like Bones he and, Bones does a lot of cool stuff. Bose and Ginger known to be in contact sometimes. They often team yeah. majors, so yeah. um, you know he would think he would have some of the same ideas as Ginger does. Chain grab going on. Uh, not a fun one to be a part of. I think it'd be Bones. super funny if uh, if Bones from the ledge, like to avoid down smash, did neutral neutral get up charge down smash himself with the invincible. <laughs> <dive>. <laughs> I don't think. I don't know if the, I don't know if that one works. I know it works on get up attack. 
Oh, it absolutely. It, on Peach's Down Smash, it works. It does work? Yeah, that's, absolutely. That's um, well, I, I guess the real trick is it has to outlast the whole Down Smash, right? Yeah, yeah. but you just keep charging it. Yeah, well, I mean, hopefully you don't start charging too early is what I'm saying. Oh, okay, I gotcha. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I guess it could work then. But I feel like Basic Stitch hasn't really been Down Smashing the ledge, like... In anticipation, he's kind of been reacting to the double lasers and throwing them out. Off of that up throw, Bones 1% too high for that neutral air to combo. Really? 1%. It works up to 120. Well, Stitch Face does more than 1%, and he tosses it. Alright. Oh! Alright. I love laser F smash, man. Like, the true... It's not exactly the true combo, but, like, catching people out of the air with it. And yeah. just Rocketing towards them. See, there's up throw up yeah, there. Yeah, and he did it off a of shine grab, too. Looks like he was uh, willing to chase basic Stitch's backside in the shield. Oh, that was another thing. Like watching uh, watching Bones and teams, he tries to jab Peach a lot. Did you see the like he like just like charged that smash for a while, and then Basic Stitch pressed one of the jump buttons, <laughs> and then proceeded to get hit by the F smash. I looked away. Okay, <laughs> yeah, that, <laughs> I totally that, missed it. That's what happened. Oh, shorten. No double lasers this time. There's the ledge dash. Yeah, man. Ooh, I really like Laser Shine, and he gets the up tilt. That is a big combo, actually, against Peach. Yeah, the, the weak there was definitely the uh, the shining star of that one. Oh, my God, gets himself back on the stage. Could have, if, if he was ultra mega next level, he could have, like, Omsitech the get-up attack, F-Smash. <laughs> I don't want to put any ideas in his head, so I hope he watches this on mute. <laughs> Just get, get some some crazy setup going. He's probably going to try to jab him here. Like, I don't know, that's kind of the feeling I'm getting. Or he's going for something new. That's not that good. Phantasm, a bit of an interesting choice. Oh my God. Not able to come back. Oh, that was an interesting laser. Because, uh, like, if he came down with Bear, there's a chance... Well, he drifted away, so that was fine. Uh, he probably would have been fine coming down with Bear. Obviously, wouldn't hit anything. But he chose to go with the lower lag option of, uh, of laser. Just kind of cover pretty much the same space. Yep, interesting up tilt. Yeah, Bones has been... Um, he used to use some up smashes before to try to anti-air Peach. And he hasn't been punished for them so far. So I guess he can keep throwing them out to prevent Peach from uh, taking to the skies. I, lo I love that nair. That was like a floaty ditto nair, where it's just like, I know there's no follow-up, I'm gonna hit you, and I'm leaving. <laughs> he just, he came up with it, and he was just gone. He's like, there's no follow-up here. Ooh, Catch is uh, basically just pressing a button with that up tilt. Ooh. Not sure why he went for bear there. Oh, that's gonna, yeah. Almost like Falcon, where it's just any move leads to dare. He just, or any any move leads to knee, just F tilt down aired him. I mean, uh, Bones is um, taking it away. Um, it looked bad at the beginning, but... Yeah, it actually looks it looked super basic stitch favored right at the start. I think he started catching just like how badly basic stitch wanted to um, enter his space, and he began you know counter poking, and uh, there you have it. Yeah, he's starting to keep out. Uh, he's just kind of winning the guessing game between putting out an aerial and uh, and a laser. See, like he's putting out that down air was like super very 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 slight drift in. Yeah. I thought that he was gonna instead of dash dance, I thought he was gonna put out an air in place, but you know, yeah, he's doing good. Should point out basic stitch uh, missed an up throw down smash opportunity. Instead, kind of let him go for the tech chase. He's kind of messing up his stuff now. He, he just caught himself like you know shaking his head at a uh, a really bad shield grab, and he knew it too. So yeah. he's aware of where he is mentally and like actually in the game. We'll see if he can pull it back. Pull some turnips. Uh, 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 pull a pull a comeback out of the ground. I don't know what yeah. I'm saying. Oh my! Pull kinda. something out of his back of tricks. Oh, there we go. Snacks <laughs> coming through. Double shine. Also, Bones. Bones is winning a lot of the shield, like the shield game mix-ups. Yeah. But it honestly sure. almost feels random. Like, oh, oh. Wow. Yeah, nice edge guard from Basic Stitch. Yeah, it really needed that. Stay in this set because after this, probably going to Yoshi's, right? Yeah. If if we even get there. Mm. Oh, I love that yeah, turnaround up, up tilt. That up tilt was definitely excellent. Jab, <laughs> forward <laughs> smash. Uh, so that, that was a super interesting jab because, like, if I was Falco in this situation, I would actually be looking for a lot of grabs, but... You'd basic be for grabs? I would look for grabs so I could, like, try to up throw up air and, and things like that, If assuming that it works. But, like, that would be my general game plan in, in that situation, but Basic Stitch wasn't putting up a shield at all. So Bones putting up that jab was pretty much his answer to me, where it's just like, yeah, I shouldn't be trying to grab basics this year. He's literally not shielding one bit, which also means this jab is kind of free. Yeah, and I think Bones. Woo I think Bones has really had a lot of success reading like a an overshot dash attack type thing. Mm -hmm. And uh, I mean, we see him using fade back down airs, the up tilts like we saw, all sorts of stuff to beat that. Yeah, there's another one. What are you uh, doing? That one was an aerial, but yeah, same story. <laughs> you know, Basic Stitch stole the lead this game. Yeah. Uh, even despite that huge combo, there's a 
turn him. Kind of locks him out of his buttons. Probably could have kept basic stage out. I love that laser. I think it helps you cover literally every wake up option. Although not with a combo. Just at least with a hitbox. Last duck, 40%. That's big because under 30%, the chain grab is very difficult. So mm -hmm. now at this point, a grab is very much the game if Basic Stitch is able to execute. I was kind of thinking the same thing, but like, I just, I don't know if Bones has really gotten grabbed too much this entire set. Just that one time at the beginning. With the uh, down the, smash? The chain, grab, oh, yeah. the, the, the chain grab finisher wasn't really there. Mm -hmm. It was just an error. So. Oh my god, just runs into him, does a little front flip on the way. See, dash like, attack, kind of desperate. See, see, like, yeah, that stock should be, like, done. Not one dash attacking out. Yeah. Laser grab. Oh, oh. Wow, what a nair. Yeah. Ooh, Basic Stitch is a fighter, man. He, you see how he countered that down air with a, like, short hop neutral air? <sighs> oh. I didn't know that was a thing. Fair out. Oh, this might be free. There's the up B. All right. So, actually, Basic Stitch... <coughs> I was about to say he did well to put it out so high so that Bones couldn't go intercept him on the way up. That's the ginger. But then he gets upbeat. Yep. Doesn't doesn't pick a great drift pattern. Let's go, Bones! I've seen Bones go for those before, too. Um, yeah. I mean, there's really no reason not to. It's not like they can get to the ground and punish you in time, so. I don't know. I feel like basic stitches used to the parasols actually kind of weak, to be honest.